welcome to our four month anniversary, Rich, of doing the word game. Four months is quite crazy, really, Ali. And we also missed a week. We did, yeah. We did. So yeah. does that mean we missed our anniversary? Damn. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's all right. So he says big cake. Or <laughs> <special shit. laughs> So this is Word Game 16? Yeah, by my calculations and why what it says on the old um, one. Mm -hmm. So as usual, we have two lists of words. One yeah. that Rich has given me, and my list that you have given me is um, children's films, and it is Toy Story, Leap, Playing with Fire, Spirit Untamed, The Star, Abominable. I have to tell you, the first time I read this, I read it as abdominal, and I, <laughs> I, can't, I can't unsee it now. <laughs> Inside Out. Wonder Park, The Incredibles, Happy Feet, Tangled, Big Hero 6, Brave, Frozen, and Sing. Excellent. Are you liking them? I am, yes. Good. It's better than this I gave you originally, wasn't it? They're by Farmyard. They got really, really quite dark. Anyway, my list Ali gave me is Cunning Revenge, I guess is Ali's theme she's given me. Mm-hmm. So that is Machiavelli, Served Cold, Enemies Close, Hurt Whom, Past, Present or Future, Harm or Progress, Cunning Plan, Baldrick. Mm -hmm. Baldrick Stein, that. Anyway, <laughs> Live Well, Thrive Beyond, Growth, Heal, Laugh, Love, Happiness is the Best Revenge. So I think we decided you were going first because I went first last time. Yeah, that's correct. In your own time? My own time. That might take several years. <laughs> Not at all. Not at all. <laughs> Many people think that Machiavelli was a person who was there to divide, conquer, cause um, intrigue and division. But what the actual plans were to coalesce, bring together, and acknowledge the differences between people. Because then revenge would not be a dish served as cold. And you wouldn't have to keep your enemies close. You keep them far, far away. Almost like Star Wars, really. And that hurt is for whom? Is that for the injured party or for the injured person? I'll let you make your own mind up. So I'm saying that the past, present and the future is dictated in the present because you could always rewrite the past, which will then, they claim, predict the future. And that may harm or progress the state that you're in. Because we all may have a cunning plan, and sometimes that does go awry. But our plan can help us live well, to help us thrive, and go beyond what we thought was possible for us. There's all that growth and that healing. Because you know those silly signs that people have right now, how it's of live, laugh, love, love, and hope, and where else they go on the people's walls. But is happiness the best revenge? Possibly not. It's a life well lived. Right? Yeah, yes. Platitudes and I can't think of all the other things that say, but yeah. Mm. Mm. Well, that was, I suppose, what I was thinking when I was writing it. The post? No, the the list. Mm -hmm. is we can spend a huge amount of time planning, plotting, and dreaming about getting a revenge. Or... The opposite. ...that time and just living well. Absolutely, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's the best thing, isn't it? It's 
live your best life that you can. And that's the biggest revenge that anybody can ever do. Yeah. I would agree. So now... You do. I have to weave a tale. Absolutely. And the question is, is it a tall story I'm weaving? Or is it a... Is it a toy story filled with imagination and universes uncharted of worlds yet to be explored? A place of imagination where we leap into the unknown because it's not really playing with fire. It is embracing our spirit untamed and encouraging the development and thriving of our imagination, our creativity, our sense of wonder. It, in a way, is practice at reaching for the stars. And there is really nothing abominable about that. I had to think about that very carefully, so I picked the right word. In fact, it's the exact opposite of abominable. In a way, it is the inside out of abominable. I'm just, I'm really pushing the boat here, because the more often I say that word, the more likely I am to get it wrong. It is the inside out of that. The opposite. It is like entering a wonder park of creativity, of limitless opportunities where the only boundaries are the incredible limitations of our own thinking. Where we can with happy feet get tangled in multiple complex tales that we revisit on many occasions that each time we craft are slightly different. We are the big hero six of our own adventures. Brave in the extreme in the face of all adversity. Never frozen to the spot because this is, after all, our adventure. And it just leaves us with that singing heart, the joy of the moment and the creativity of our own minds. Very nice. Good and, job. Until next time. Until next time. I like how you got the abominable right and not the <laughs> abominable. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but each time I did, I was very conscious that I'm like, no, uh-huh. Oh, no. <laughs> Segment it off, otherwise this is going to go wrong. <laughs> go wrong, yeah. <laughs> thank you, and until next thank time. Thank you very much for listening, and thank you very much for watching. And for next time... See you soon.